What's up guys? Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's a girl back again, one boy. Hope you guys are awesome. Hope you're doing good. As for me, I'm very good. I can't complain much. So guys, um, first and foremost, as you all can see, I'm heavily dressed because it is so cold. Uh, I don't know if it's in Nairobi, I'm in the whole of Kenya, I'm a Nimimi, I don't know, but it is cold. Uh, that's why I'm wearing this sweater and this heavy hoodie. Yeah, but that aside, that is not why we're here today. The main reason why I am doing this video is because I have some good news for you all. Yeah, if for most of you, if not you all. Personally, to me, it was good news. Sour. So let's get straight to the point, guys. We have been really struggling to get pure honey for the longest time, even and I, because most of the time we want to like make dawa, ama we want to cook food with some honey and everything we want to consume honey generally na hatujai hatujakuwa tukipata jokuwa na bahati ya kupata pure honey we've tried supermarket honeys we've tried honeys from uh, wamasai from shops from everywhere but it is really hard to find pure honey if you are a consumer of honey you understand how much hard it can be to get pure honey and um I decided, okay, uh, my mom is a camera. Okay, you all know, you've watched my videos, my previous videos of our road trip uh, to Mwingi. Yeah, and uh, during our road trip, I managed to go to, my mom took me to somewhere where we managed to get honey. My mom is a, my mom is born and raised, uh, my mom was born and raised in Kitui County. So, anajua mashimo zote za kupata vitu kama honey, and you all know, Places Kama Kitui County, those are the main places where you can get like pure natural honey from. You get guys. So uh before that, before twenty that road trip, and I was always mentioning to her how much I want honey. Na Ananambia. If you want honey, you go to Kwakina Shosho. You'll get a lot of honey from there. But now time and distance and everything. But finally, things happened, and before we went, we all went, uh, uh, you all, if you watched that video, before we went for that road trip stroke visit, my mom had gone earlier, na akanikujia na honey from there, and I really loved that honey, and you guys, that was pure honey, it was pure natural honey, yani, with no preservatives, no additives, no nothing. And uh, I loved it, and I, I, I decided when we go together for now that uh, visit, we're going to go. I'm going to go and now bring come with honey for us and also for for sell. And that is what happened. So we went, to, uh, we went, we saw, we conquered, and uh, yeah, we came back with honey. And that is what I'm going to show you today. So you all can see up on my angle, we have those packaging uh, containers. Those are the containers that I'm using for now. Let me just show you these ones. These are the containers that I'm using for now. So package uh, the honey for my clients. I had already mentioned it to my Instagram followers. To my, uh, I had already mentioned it on my socials. That is Instagram, TikTok, uh, WhatsApp, and also Facebook. But I realized that not all of you who watch my videos have, uh, are following me on my social so that's why I decided to do this video for you guys so on today's video I want to show you guys how I'll be packaging the honey I'm going to show you the honey and how I'll be packaging it uh, because I've been getting orders lately and uh, uh, time, time to measure immediately like to package it immediately because unapata maybe I need to go somewhere so I've decided to just package like a little bit uh maybe three four or five so that in case someone orders i can just easily deliver without having to like uh do the measurements and everything because even measuring the honey and packaging it it can be kind of messy so that's why i'm doing that in advance and i've started to do it with you guys so that i can show you the honey and uh, so that we can filter with you guys and so that we can package with you guys and i'm also going to give you details of how you can place your order pochini i deliver i'll be delivering okay i do deliveries countrywide and yeah i'm going to give you to leave my contact i'm a 
a way of to a way you guys can reach me and also the prizes opportunity so, so stay tuned let's start let me show you the honey kio kwa bucket then tuanze kumisha saweni yeah i hope you guys muna enjoy and also comment let me know what you think about this whole video the honey and the entire video and also please make sure you like you know you guys nikipata kitu mzuri and it it our benefit usually try my best to bring you guys to 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 do what quality to make it available for you guys so please like the video subscribe in case you've not subscribed because most of you have not subscribed and comment let me know what you think about the video so let's get started So guys, uh, this is the honey. As you can see, the honey, the beaker, the honeycombs, and the and some of the bees in our float kwa the honey. But we have our honey here. Very pure. Very pure. So um, using this. I'm using this here to filter the honey to remove this but in case a client wants uh, the honey if you're in a honeycombs I'll not filter it that much yep so that's it guys that's the honey before packaging it so I'm going to use the this kitchen here in this jug I'll be filter filtering the honey to this uh, container here to this jar then from here I'll now be using it to I'll not be using I'll not be uh, measuring this in this one you get it you get it yeah so uh, to keep the honey okay this is a story for another time but to keep the honey good like uh, pure you have to cover it to store it well when it is covered to avoid water or humidity because it will ruin your honey yep so let's get into it uh about uh, measuring i'm using this kitchen scale to do my measurements it's very accu accurate i used for uh, i used i looked for a very accurate the best and the most accurate uh scale or weighing machine to use that is not very bulky and I got this one so this is what I'm using to measure my honey with so let's get started let's now start uh, packing the honey for our next potential clients by worth i desire your worst so you can just hide while i work i ain't tired you first i'll write a second third verse about the lies you go disperse hi guys so i finished filtering my honey 
we have it here uh, and we have our clean uh, containers here clean and dried containers here uh, tip uh, when dealing with honey you have to make sure that you avoid water and humidity at all costs so once I clean my containers really uh, make sure that they are well dried yeah not to interfere with the quality of my honey so I'm going to measure most 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 honey that I'm going to package the package na quasi containers um, 500 grams because those are the ones that are mostly ordered for so tunanza na is in dogo kwanza the small ones the 500 kg ones then one kg yeah so i'll be measuring uh, i'll be measuring two kgs i'm a more on orders but for now i'm just packing them for this half kg and one kg containers yep so let's start hoping that you're not going to make any mess You're hoping that I could drop on any mess. Uh, 500 grams. We have our 500 grams. Ah, it says what to upload in shower, but. You just know it is 500 grams. So once I measure na funika, that way we have our honey there. So let's do that to the next one. Four point nine six four point nine nine five plus five grams it is five hundred grams it is so tunafunika tunaeka so I think tutenda mo tutafanya this can in Kajago men is small one, so I cannot like filter a lot of honey using it. But I'm going to buy better containers and jars and all those. But for now we're working with what we have. We are working with what we have. Oops. I'm also doing a TikTok video, so Ooh. so we have our honey down. So I'm going to filter more because uh, this jug in accommodate only three five hundred grams, so that's one point five kg only. So I'm going to filter more so that I can fill in these other containers. And yeah, that's it, guys. So in case you are in need of honey, in case you are in need of pure natural honey, uh, hit me up, DM me. Um, follow my honey page, my honey business page on Instagram, Pure Harvest Honey. Utepata po Instagram at Pure Harvest Honey. Just search Pure Harvest Honey. Uta to um, For the 500 grams honey, in enda for 500 bob. And then for the, I wish I could have measured one for this one. 
you can see the difference in size. I don't know whether you guys can see the difference. This one is quite big. It's uh, bigger. It's double the size. For the 1 kg one, it ended up for 900 bob. So if you buy uh, 1 kg, 900. If you buy half a kg, ni 500. So that makes this one a bit cheaper. So it's up to you to know which one to go with. Yep. So that is it for today's video. In case you need of honey, please DM me. Uh, comment a uh do what else you can DM, DM me on my Instagram my business page connect to the DM bora message in Nikia so and remember we deliver country wide for you guys so make sure you place your order today and I'll get you sorted so that is it for today see you on my next one bye peace Bu ni kati ya kwenye fungia. Hmm, apa? Ku tasha kurekod.